The Ghana Wildlife Conservation and Management Commission, which falls under the purview of the Department of the Environment, will this year continue to focus on building its capacity by implementing measures aimed at strengthening its legal and institutional framework. Details from Stacey Carmichael. Head of the Guyana Wildlife Conservation and Management Commission, GWCMC, Alona Sankar, during a sector review, said the commission is working on the development of a 10-year strategic plan and building its human resource capacity. The GWCMC is also working on developing regulations on the hunting, trapping, trade, protection, conservation, management, and sustainable use of wildlife. Minister of State Joseph Harmon called for the finalizing of these regulations to be expedited so that they can be operationalized. This, he said, is key to the work of the Commission and committed to addressing the challenges, which include financial and human resource constraints. There are some issues which we have to deal with on a one-on-one, -on -one, which some of it has to do with the, the way in which some of your responsibilities reside in another, um, another department's um, act. I think we need to streamline those and get them fixed during the course of 2018. GWCMC will also be working on regulations on the design, management and operation of wildlife holding premises, the international and local wildlife trade and the development of licensing process for commercial dealers. For 2017, the Commission successfully granted 24 commercial exportation licenses, 23 holding premises licenses and 714 permits. For Infohub, Stacey Carmichael. Thank you.